Hey everybody, I just made this video, I have to make it again because I don't feel like editing it, and I made it too long, but here's the review of my G9X, G9X, laser gaming mouse, it's a very ergonomical, comfy grip, like I just changed it to the laser mouse, or the fattier grip, comfortable grip, than the precision grip, which is a lot thinner, the grips are interchangeable, you just press this little button back here, and it pops up. Then you just put it on, click it. It has eight programmable buttons. You have two on the side, two for your DPI changing. You can change the DPI on this. This is to be. You have your uh, right, left click, your back and forward buttons, or whatever there. Then your DPI buttons. You cannot ever change the programming for this button right here. I do kind of look like, like, look at that, it looks like a single finger or something. Like on a skeleton or something. I don't know. That's what I got out of it, because it like breaks up there and stuff. Looks like it was just made for one finger or something. I don't know. I just kind of like the look of that. It like breaks off and stuff. Then your uh, mouse, or your scroll click, then your, you have left and right scroll click clicks also. It like kind of pivots each way. I have that set up for volume so I can easily change the volume on my uh, computer. You can, this this does have the micro gear which can change it from the clicky type. Press that. Press the button right there on the bottom and it goes super super fast. Super super fast. <laughs> like my singing I knew you guys would. This is, you can change the weight of your mouse. Like I keep mine loaded up with 28 grams. They give you a four seven gram cartridges. And then they give you this nice little carrying case too. Ah, I just dropped it and threw it. It says G9X on it. But you get four others. I keep mine fully loaded. I don't know why, but I do. Uh, you have a. You, it's a really fast, or it's a gaming gate, gaming, gaming grade laser on it that like senses the the DPI sensor, whatever they're called nowadays, optical ones, uh, laser ones, whatever. <laughs> I have a Seal Series mini mouse pad. Or it's not really called that, I just call it that because it's like the small one. And it was the cheapest one out of the gaming mouse pads that I bought. Or the cheapest one they had over at Micro Center. When I bought my mouse and everything because I could not find a mouse pad anywhere. Even though my mom has like two Tim McGraw ones. Could not find them anywhere. Uh, has a braided cable. My braiding kind of ripped a little here. Oh, I kind of ripped it also. Being me, I did that. You can change. It has... I don't know how many it has on it, but you can create so many. It has onboard memory for your, uh... Like, profiles. You can have it for video. Like, this is my videoing one that doesn't really work. My gaming, then my everyday or general use. You just press a little button there and press your DPI changers. And then you have those buttons, uh... You have a Teflon, pretty sure that's a Teflon, uh, mouse slider things that lets you slide it and stuff. Pretty slidey. I'm, I'm getting a new mouse pad actually when I get my graphics card. I'm getting the uh, TI, or no, no not the TI, <laughs> the EVGA uh, NVIDIA GeForce GTX 560 Duke Nukem Edition, which comes with a mouse pad and a belt buckle and a book in the game. And that's basically the only reason I'm getting it is for that stuff. I don't never play the game except for a little bit of the demo. Didn't even beat, or, yeah, didn't even beat the first level. <laughs> Cause my laptop was so laggy. Wowzers. <laughs> but. Me, I get into games with the uh, with the special editions. That me, that's me. I'll buy a special edition of a game I never heard of. 
or a game I've never played like Grand Theft Auto. Never played it once in my life. My friend told me about it when I bought when I bought my first Xbox. When right when uh you could pre-order this uh, stuff for uh, GTA. I got the special edition with the duffel bag and the brief or the lockbox. Lockbox sucks. So the duffel bag. I mean the duffel bag holds up pretty well except for the zipper. It breaks. The zipper breaks. <sighs> but all the, other than that. I, that's the stuff. I, I, other than that, the stuff that you get with the game is pretty cool. But this mouse, I do recommend it. I bought it for the price. The price generally is around uh, sixty dollars. No, around eighty dollars retail, which is outrageous. I did not pay retail. I got mine cheaper because they broke the seal on the box, then returned it and ripped the box. I wasn't going to buy this mouse unless I got it cheaper, because I have this Darkfield mouse, or this other, <laughs> Darkfield, this Logitech Anywhere, MX, MX Anywhere, or X, Anywhere MX mouse, that I'm going to do a review on tomorrow night, because it's late, and I'm going to bed, but this is the mouse, it's uh, pretty good, love it, love the grip, like I forget all what I talked about in the last video. But it's uh, pretty fast. Go watch a uh, Linus Tech Tips unboxing video on this. I'll put a link to the to the video in, in this. Then check out his channel afterwards. He does a lot of computer stuff, gaming, computer stuff, not just computer stuff. All about gaming. I love his channels. Then check out a uh, NCIX. NCIX Esther's channel, Esther's channel, I'll put a link in her, I might put a dis link into her channel in the description, I'm not big on typing and stuff, but that's, there's the, uh, mouse, but if you want gaming stuff, go to gaming computer stuff, not, he doesn't do a lot of, uh, Xbox or anything like that, but he does do a lot of PC stuff, well, he works for a PC company that does a lot of custom gaming stuff and stuff. But there's all that. You, uh. I do recommend this. The. This is something I do have to redo. <laughs> but, uh. The connector for this is a. One of those old fashions. Luckily, I had an old fashioned one on my laptop. No, I had a converter for it. But. Huh? Got you guys. <laughs> you all should have seen the look on your faces. <laughs> it's a regular USB. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah. You know what's the funny part about it is the sarcasm. I can't see your faces. <laughs> but it has a regular USB connector and a long cord. Well, not really long. It's like long for a mouse. About regular size for a mouse, actually. But there's the video. Or the video. There's the review. I recommend it. Go out and buy it. I do recommend the mouse pad. Like it comes with a sticker that I'm already put on the back of my PC or my laptop because I have a ton of stickers on them. But I recommend it if you can get a price drop. I'm very buy, be to buy a $350 motherboard and a $245 graphics card, and I need to get the rest of the stuff dirt cheap. But there's that. I recommend it. Go out and buy it. I'm doing like a flippy hand thingy with the recording of my bandage. I injured my hand. Don't ask what or how. But yeah, there's my video.